Numbers go up to the windows upstairs. That's where that's that's the son's room. A series of bullet holes can be seen across the front of this house near 154th and 28th Avenue in Surrey. Police evidence markers showing at least a dozen bullet holes and the back of this white Tesla parked in the driveway shattered. Inside the house, bullet holes through the window of this room, which Meninder Singh with the BC Gurdwaras Council says is the bedroom of the owner's six-year-old son. Up to 20 plus shots fired into his home. Um, including up to about two feet away from a, his six-year-old that was sleeping upstairs and went right by his bed. It was quite a horrifying scene for him. Singh identifying the owner of the home as Simranjit Singh, a well-known pro-Khalistan activist, and according to Singh, a close friend of slain Surrey temple leader Hardeep Singh Nijer. He was actually just in his living room right there. So. Multiple bullets hitting the front door as well. Grant Christie lives across the street from the house. He says he was woken up to what he believes were gunshots. You could tell the sharp crack and just so quiet. And just, there's something, something bad. Well, whatever, you, you jump out of bed and you, you look out your window to see what happened. But it's all quiet until a bunch of police showed up, you know, 15 minutes later. Christie says nothing like this has ever happened in this neighborhood before. Let's hope that uh, it doesn't escalate, but uh, it's been a pretty calm quiet street for 20 years. Yeah, that's sad because I saw a couple little kids leaving the house at 2 in the morning. Mounties calling it an isolated incident. The investigation is in still very early stages, so motive of this shooting has not been determined out of this time. Singh says the family believes the two shootings are related, but police are not confirming any links to Niger, whose death Prime Minister Justin Trudeau alleges has connections to the Indian government. We are aware of the speculation that's going on social media right now, what's been posted. I can tell you that we're working with the family very closely and they are cooperative with us. Police are urging anyone with information to come forward. Janella Hamilton, CBC News, Surrey.